live on. Y'all get ready to tune in. We got some good gifts today on See the Lotus Zone. Okay, See us every day. Um, Look, in, okay? we're giving away something different today. Yeah, so Tablets on Tuesday, on Technology Tuesday. But today, we're giving away something else. So you better tell everybody to call in. Get ready for us. Are we on Facebook also? No, I'm oh, I'm talking on the website. You talking on YouTube? Right, get ready um, on YouTube. Council, uh, we on the council Facebook. Tell oh, everybody okay. you know. Got some good information. I, we got Dr. Gilmore back again today. I'm he back. gonna be with us every Sunday. Every Sunday. Every Looking Sunday. To it. Every Sunday. That's right. We gonna he gonna say all the stuff that I can. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> Tuesdays and Sundays Tuesdays at 4 o'clock. At 4 o'clock. Uh -huh. Tell everybody to the tune Lotus in. Zones. <clears throat> Technology Tuesday. 106.1 and on Facebook Live. You ready to go live? Okay, on the website? Yeah, yeah. go ahead. Okay. All right, well, allow me to do the jingle and play and all that. Don't do that. What you doing, team? Okay. Ah, we're about to get started. Yeah. We're getting started. We're going to get started early. We're testing the system out today. Testing, testing. We're giving one, the, two. the seniors say, I don't give them enough time Can to come in. Us? Can so you see seniors. us? Send us some messages. Go ahead. Now you got time, seniors. <laughs> we haven't started giving away anything. We haven't started giving away nothing. They calling already. <laughs> the Lotus Zone is coming on hot at 4 o'clock. Who oh, is this? Let's see. Council on Aging. Lotus Zone. Lotus Zone, how can I help you? We ain't even started yet. But you on. Keep that number. You we got it. We haven't started yet. We haven't started yet. <laughs> no, not yet. Not yet. Alright. What's All your right. name? What's your name? You're about 30 minutes too early. You're about 10, 15 minutes early, but you ready. Now get ready. Watch us on Facebook, Miss Crockett. You going to watch us on Facebook? That's right. Yeah, I'm watching it. All right. Okay, All right. call back in a few minutes, Miss Crockett. All right. All right, bye. Miss <laughs> Crockett say, what number am I? She ready. She ready. Look, because um. today... We're giving away Google Home Hubs today. Yeah. We're going to teach you how to do Alexa in your house. You can say, Alexa, turn on the TV. Alexa, yep. cut the lights on and all. Google, play me some jazz. Play me some good old-fashioned <coughs> music. Tim, what you doing? Huh? What is Tim doing? We getting ready. <coughs> Miss Crockett is already out, up and ready. She knows the number and the extension. <laughs> she is ready. We on the website. We on the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging website. For those of you that are new to the Lotus Zone, mm -hmm. you can uh, go on www.ebrcoa.org and check us out. Click the link that says Lotus Zone. Click on that. Takes you straight to the radio show. We're on the Lotus Zone. And we are on WTQT. 106.1. There you go. Call letters mm -hmm. and numbers. Mm -hmm. You can listen to us on the radio. But here's what we're going to do. During these pandemic times, we're going to teach the seniors virtual activities, virtual program. We want you all to learn how to get involved and engaged in the virtual activities. And that's why we started this program. So we can make sure that we can stay connected with you all. So we're gonna get started in a few minutes. We got five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes, and we're gonna start the show. We got a great show coming up. We we're gonna talk about some good stuff. Yeah, how to stay healthy. How to stay healthy. You James, gotta survive this COVID. That's right. How your mama doing, James? My mom's doing good. She's doing all right. She's looking for some uh, perch. She want me to bring her some perch. She wants you. She gonna. Fry, she wants you to cook it or just bring it. Bring back? it. She can fry it herself. She said. Right. Okay. <laughs> she said she can fry it herself. <laughs> well, that's good. That's good. Chief Dunn, I believe Chief Dunn gonna be tuned in. Chief Dunn, Chief Carl yeah. Dunn, our good board member. Yeah. That's right. Our good board member. Our good board chairwoman. Hope she's gonna listen today, Miss Jerry Booker. Yeah. We learned that she got a long first name. I just learned that last Sunday. Oh, it's not Jerry? Mm -mm, it's got some extra stuff on it. Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't know that. Yeah, Mr. Anderson taught us that last week. Okay. Jerry Dean or Jerry, something like that. <laughs> I can't get it all. It's long. 
Then we got good. We have uh, great good, board members. We have great board yeah, members. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Miss Jerry Booker is our chairwoman, our vice chair, of course. Everybody knows state, state representative mm -hmm. C. Denise Marcel. Be sure to tag her in this also, okay? Our treasurer is Jennifer Moisant, attorney mm -hmm. Jennifer Moisant. She has she was our chair for a good long time. Um, and then she is now our sitting treasurer. How does a person become a member of your board? Well, all you have to do is oh. hold on, Miss Day Calling. Let's see. Lotus Zone. Lotus Zone, Council on Aging. Hi, just wanted to make sure I'm calling in at the right number. I want to win the iPad and also Alexa. All right, then, Miss, uh, what's your name? Bonnie Goche. Hey, Miss Bonnie Goche, how you doing? I'm doing good. Who am I talking with? This is Tasha. I'm doing good, darling. Look, you got the right number. Okay, so when good. we get started, you listen up for us to drop the number so you you know when to call. Okay, thank you. All right. Tasha, Tell who you say hello. Tell Tasha I say hello. Okay, I will. We love our seniors. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, we receive it. And we send it right back to you. Yes, yes, right back to you. All right. Bye bye. So <laughs> That's so sweet. We just love our we love seniors. seniors. They ready to date. Mm -hmm. Now, the call in number, because some people remember from last week 923 8000, extension 359, and you'll get us directly. That's the call in number. But we're going to announce when it's time to call in, okay? 8000, yes. extension 359. We'll let you. <laughs> We're going to let you know when to call, when to call in. in. Okay. We're going to let you know when to call in. But yeah, this is a good, this is, since this is a good time. And look, we also going to tell you the rules of engagement. Because starting on Tuesday, we're going to play bingo on the radio and internet. Nobody in the city. No, wow. nobody in the state. Jones. I haven't heard of bingo. We're playing video and radio bingo. Wow. We're going to have good prizes. Bingo. What you say? For fun. It's for fun. You don't have to have no gaming license as long as it's for fun. Oh, yeah, this is fun. This is for fun. Okay, so don't have the gaming license. People call us on Monday. Talk about we talking gaming. Talking about we breaking the gaming laws. <laughs> this is bingo this is for, for fun. for fun. And for senior yes, citizens. Yes, yes. And so if you're not a senior, you can't play. This yep. is straight bingo for the seniors. But anyway, so we look forward to, uh, to Lotus. What we calling it, Trudy? What's the bingo call? We call Lotus Zone Bingo. Lotus Zone Bingo. bingo. Radio Bingo. Radio Bingo. Okay. I'm going to tell you, that was, was not my idea. Mr. Ernest Attorney, Ernest Johnson, gave me that idea. Wow. And he said, I'm telling you, the seniors would love it. Go do it. I said, wow. oh, he dropped it on me, and I'm doing it. So thank you, Mr. Yeah, Attorney Ernest idea. Johnson. Thank you. Thank we you. appreciate that. Mm -hmm. Yep. How we looking, team? Ready. We good. It's fine you. We ready? We're going to get started in a minute. Oh, I didn't know if you locked me out. You know you selfish with your little stuff. No, We're going to talk right. about coronavirus. It's serious, y'all. And these young people. Yeah. Woo, they got me burnt up, though. Yeah, young people, you, you don't give it, don't catch it, don't give it to your grandparents and your parents. They don't even know if they had. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be very careful out there, young people. The numbers mm -hmm. are showing. <laughs> these young people acting up out here in the Baton Rouge streets. And grandparents, seniors, tell your grandkids. So don't come to my don't house. Don't come by the house. I don't know where you've been. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna talk about Corona times. Mm -hmm. Walk around with no mask on. Yeah, I'm and their put, masks are everywhere now. Nobody should not have a I'm mask. Put you can get a free mask everywhere now. <laughs> I'm gonna tell their mom. I'm gonna put me some people on blast in here today. Keep them in your I car. Hope they, you, you can wear a bandana. I hope you can Tim wear a mom, bandana. Timothy, my mama is listening today. I show sure hope it so I can tell. I'm gonna snitch. I'm gonna dry snitch today. I'm telling your mama. <laughs> Wear my mask. <laughs> Young people, wear your mask. Mm -hmm. Don't bring home the corona to your parents and that's grandparents right. and great grandparents. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. Until you, um, until you CEO that's of age. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. how many more minutes before we? Live in five minutes. minutes. Okay, we got five minutes. Five minute countdown. Tag somebody on Facebook and invite them to watch the show. And seniors, call somebody, everybody from the Florida Boulevard Center. Get on the phone and call somebody from the Florida Boulevard Center and tell them to chime in and tune in today. And everybody from Jewel J. Newman Center, yeah. call somebody. 
from the Greater King David Center. Yep. And from the Zachary Center. And from Tim Baker. And from Tim's favorite center. You know mm. Tim's favorite oh, center? Who's your favorite center? Central oh, Senior you know, Center. Sylvia okay. Sylvia Betts on there watching. Oh, Ooh, I got something to tell you when the that? show come on, Miss <laughs> Betts. I got something to tell you. About oh, him man. and his mask. I got right, something right, to tell you. Go yeah, go get your mask right now because he don't have it on right now. That's right. Mm-hmm. And then Tim's favorite center is the Central Senior Center. He oh, loves yeah? it in Central. Okay. Mm-hmm. And the what Baker he, Center. What does he like most about Central? The area. Okay. I think he likes the area, the okay. locale. The locale. You still got Homewood out there? Got Homewood. With the pool. Homewood. Homewood with the yeah. pool. Then we got Perkins Road Senior Center. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got one on Highland Road. Okay. In the Highland Road Park. Did you ever move out to Gardier? We do. Yeah. At the okay. uh, Ben Bird ben Senior Birds. Center. That's okay. right. With and that's a partnership with Breck, huh? All those are okay. partnerships with Breck. You're exactly right. We okay. got Antioch Senior Center. Yeah, it's one okay. of the largest ones we have. Shout out to Antioch. I love them. They love it. And Dumas House. Oh yeah. Can't Doom can't forget about Dumas House. Dumas House just got them on a, a, a new a new six hundred thousand dollar parking see, lot. We need to definitely talk about we that when talk we talk about, about updates that. on updates. construction. Updates. That's right. Dumas yeah, House. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we have Turner Plaza right here on okay. North Street. Mm-hmm. And then we have uh, Catholic Presbyterian right downtown. Mm-hmm. Ooh, and then we got some new stuff coming. I can't wait. So, James, yes. I can't wait. Ms. Amor is going to talk about the new construction. Mm-hmm. Towards the end of the show, you have to stay tuned. You gotta stay if tuned. If you want to learn about these new buildings that's and right. renovations that's coming. That's right. She's going to talk about it at the end of the show. Everybody wants to uh, know what's going on with the new construction. That's right. She's going to provide a good update. Oh, Tim. Come around here to the film, to the camera, so uh, Miss Best can see you got your mask on. You had to go put your mask on. Go on, get in the. Say hey, Tim. Finally, young gonna people put his wear mask your mask, on. young people. Put your mask on. That's right, cause we're gonna dry snitch. You know what we're gonna start doing, James? Mm. Everybody we see in public mm-hmm. that we know that know somebody we know, yep. they don't have that mask on. We'll put their name on Facebook. That's right. Because mm-hmm. I bet you their mama don't know they walk around right. without, without a mask, a mask on. Because it's going up in their house. Because it don't mess their outfit. <laughs> <laughs> so, look, if y'all see my daughter, if y'all see Ayana Amar, Miss Hairology of Bad Rooms out there with a, out a mask. I Call like me. that hairology. I like that. Yes, yeah, the science of hair, she says. Yeah, Call me. Yeah. I will snatch her and no matter what her age is. <laughs> Call me. I will snatch her in the middle of the Republic. Get this mask on, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Very important, y'all wear your mask. Yes, All right, say hello. This is Lotus on. Can I help you? Yes, this is Mildred Webster. Hey, Miss Webster, how are you? I'm good. We hadn't started yet, but Miss Webster, we're going to start in a little while. We're about to start the show in a few minutes, and then we're going to tell you what number you can call in and win, okay? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. You got the right number, though. You on it. You early. You ready. Yes, ma'am, I am. All right, Ms. Webster. All right, bye-bye. Okay. <laughs> All right. Trudy, we ready to get started? In three minutes. Okay. All right. Tag a friend. Invite other folks to watch us on Facebook Live. We got a really good show for you here at Lotus Zone. That's right. Uh, all things seniors. Talking about seniors and how we can continue to improve the lives, the quality of life of seniors. That's right. Technology, health, well, everything. And prosperity. And prosperity. That's and true. for anybody that's taking care of a senior, that's you right. also want to tune into this show. That's right. This show talks about those who have and a care for their seniors. anybody that services. has a senior in your family. Absolutely. You got a, a grandmama, a, a grandfather. A great uncle you're great taking uncle, care of. Parents. This is the radio show to tune into. That's right. Mm-hmm. Every Tuesday and Sunday at 4 p.m. That's right. Mm-hmm. Tuesday and Sunday. And every Sunday we'll have the good doctor with us. Yeah, I'll be here every Sunday with y'all. Every Sunday, Dr. James Gilmore. He's going to drop the knowledge on us because he's not a doctor of the body. He's a doctor of the mind. <laughs> I like that. No, I don't do surgery. You'll do surgery? No, I don't do surgery. Mm-hmm. I, I let Doc take his seat today. Oh, well, is that what he said? For, miss, I was looking for you. James, I have... I used How to, you doing, Miss Anderson? I got a good friend, Dr. Cato. People used to say... Doc, I need you to help me. My 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 knees hurting. He used to say, "Well, well, the only way I can help you because I'm a education doctor. Get on your knees and pray." <laughs> <laughs> All right, we gonna get ready. Yeah, we're about to get ready, y'all. Oh, I gotta put my headphones yeah, so on. Yeah, so we can hear our jingle. Facebook need to be able to hear our jingle. They need to be able to hear. It. Have they heard? We don't have a speaker in the studio. 
106.1, testing. Oh, nothing's coming through my ears, is that okay? Not yet. Oh, okay. You're on mute. You're on mute right We getting ready for the radio? We got our executive producer in the house, Ms. Trudy Bim. Trudy Bim. Howard. Howard. Trudy Bim Howard is our Howard. executive producer. Trudy Bim Howard. <laughs> <laughs> our uh, web developer and uh, camera folks, Amanda Scott. Yep. And Timothy Moore running the Facebook channels, with, finally with a mask on. So we're <laughs> grateful for the, these young people. They in that 18 to 30 club yep. that's around here, making everybody not feel well. <laughs> okay, here we go. Age. When can they hear it? No. So the Jenga is playing. Council on Aging. Council on Aging. Good East afternoon. Baton Rouge. Council, Council on, on aging. aging. Good afternoon and welcome to the Lotus Zone. I'm Tasha Clark Amar, your co-host for the day. And we have the infamous doctor, <laughs> the good doctor. James Gilmore, thank you so much for having me again every Sunday, on this show. Dr. Every Gilmore Sunday. will be with us every Sunday. Absolutely. Today's topic is how to stay safe and healthy in these Rona streets. Now, they told me not to say that. <laughs> But you know, I just Absolutely. go with it. How to stay healthy, seriously, during these uh, pandemic times. Um, and look, we always start with a quote of the day. Now, so today's quote says, age is an issue of mind over matter. If you don't mind, it don't matter to me. <laughs> That's, That's what Mark right. Twain said. Mark Twain said. <laughs> if you age doesn't is mind, an issue if you don't mind, mind, it doesn't matter That's to me. Right. That's, That's right. right. And then won't you go with the COO's tip of the day? Okay. Shan Rika Shan Barrow's Rika Barrow. tip of the day. Here's her tip of the day. Happiness. Happiness is not having what you want. That's right. It is appreciating what you have. That's right. If you got good life and breath still Absolutely. in your body, you, you, should you should be appreciative. Happy. You should be you should happy, be happy. At all time. Exactly. Be thankful be for thankful. what you have. Be thankful. So we want to start, we're going to start with, <clears throat> first of all, some updates, we're gonna do updates. We wanna start with, we had a very, very, very successful Lotus Food Pantry in Zachary. We were asked, you know, Dr. Gilmore, after the last one we did at the Louisiana Leadership Institute, I, we were worn out, I said well, we weren't gonna do anymore. But they called and they called and they, they asked a great Senator uh, Regina Barrow to get, uh, to ask us to do one and they called uh, Judge Yvette Alexander and then, uh, Councilman Trey Welch called me and said, please, please, Sasha, you got to do something for the folks in Zachary because they didn't get an opportunity to come out. So Zachary, Pryport, Hudson, and Cheneyville. Yeah, so it was did, a bit distance for them. It was a bit say, distance right. for them. Mm -hmm. So we did a great food pantry in Zachary. Borden's Milk came. They brought 2,000 one-gallon wow. jugs of Appreciate uh, that, Borden milk. milk. 2% milk, that good milk. Yeah. 2% <laughs> milk. That's James. healthy. That's part of y'all uh, right. requirements, huh? You have to provide right. uh, nutritional. That's right. Yeah. And then we had Merchant Food Service that gave us uh, nice fruit and vegetables. We had uh, the Cajun Navy Commissary and okay. the Cajun Navy. Okay. They brought great items. And not only, but besides bringing things, they worked. They worked tyrants yeah. with us. Okay. They really worked. Uh, was the food bank there? The Greater Baton Rouge Food okay. Bank. All right. And uh, and Borden's and out of this out of the events with Borden, not they like what we did so much that they have committed for the next until August thirty first to bring us two thousand gallons of milk a week. Wow! Until August thirty first for all the clients, all the Meals on Wheels clients, because you know we serve about nineteen hundred and seventy two clients a week um, at the homes wow. who don't get an opportunity to come out 
Over 1,900 so, homebound seniors receive meals from you all. Yes. Every week. Every week. Every wow. week. And so now that they will get a gallon of milk a week from Borden. Yeah. So, milk, so, milk is an essential part of nutrition. Yeah, That's right. Yeah, absolutely. So it's the Lord 2% is good. Milk, so it's, it's, really as long good. as you're doing the right thing, yes. he'll make sure to send what you He blesses you, you in need. overflow. He blesses you in overflow. In, in overflow. Yeah. Because in the way overflow. I think you work it with your budget That's right. is... Uh, the food bank and others partner, but then you also have to put some put, put some in through, out of right. your budget. That's right. In order to make sure there's enough for everyone. And then we have a lot of new people now, so you know the budget is really really tight. It's been stretched, and uh, this is just going to be some great help for us yeah. to be able to provide for extra seniors. You know, we have an extra two or three thousand seniors that we're helping every week now that we never had before. Right. Since the pandemic, the... since COVID. So, so what? Tell me this. What made you come up with uh, the idea of this drive through? Like. You know, well, you know, we weren't, we, we were trying to limit our exposure to oh, the seniors. Gotcha. Um, and our the congregate settings are closed, so senior centers are closed, and there's no way to get the items to them. So, we decided drive through, pop your trunk, we don't really have to, you know, interact with you, mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. and we can give you the items and you can be about your way. And because this way, it limits them also from having greater exposures in the store, in the trying to get stores, these yeah. items that mm -hmm. may or may not be there. You right, know? Right. And so, I mean, we had, when I tell you these bags were the best bags, really? we had pork chops, hamburger really patties, bread and Good. milk and butter and, Good. you know, I, I needed a bag, but you know, <laughs> but I'm not a senior. <laughs> It was some well, really, really great, good bags. Great, so, great. so it it was really, really good. But thank um, you, Zachary, and uh, thank you, Zachary, and the East Baton Rouge Parish Sheriff Office. Okay, they were all there. Helping phenomenal, phenomenal. Because you, you always got traffic. Always, yeah. and they were there from like three thirty in the morning until we finished, and they help. They load cars, and they, you know, they're very, very patient with the seniors. Even when the seniors lose their patience, <laughs> they still they was like, okay, ma'am, come on. But they they were they were awesome. And thank you to all those. Uh, citizens of Zachary that right. probably had to wait in traffic or you couldn't get where you needed to get mm -hmm. in a timely manner. That's Thank right. you for respecting and understanding That's that, right. you know, we needed to feed the seniors in that in that area. And so that little time of inconvenience to you is worth it to get right. a meal or meals to our seniors. And, and thank you. A big shout out of thanks to the Zachary school system, uh, Superintendent Scott Diesel. Um, he was he was awesome. Oh yeah, because you, you did it at the Copper Mill. At Copper Mill, Elementary. which is a very nice school, okay. right? Yes, it is. Yeah, it's it a is. really nice school. Good. So yeah, we did it there. It's, you know, it don't have nothing on Southern Lab, but hey, <laughs> <laughs> nothing on that lab. But it was, it, was, it was nice for Zachary. It was, it was nice. <laughs> also, also, Doc, we are still in the in the throes of. COVID-19 testing for our seniors. It started on Friday, on Thursday of last week at Care South on Florida Boulevard. And they still have here. Look, if you go get tested, drive-through testing for seniors. Each senior that goes through, mm -hmm. up to the 600 senior, is getting a $25 Visa gift card. They wow. get a gift card to do whatever they want. And they're getting their name put in a hat to win a 55-inch TV. Wow. But on top of that, you get to know if you're walking around asymptomatic and you have um, the virus and so you know what you need to do and if you being this, have been exposed or not. So it's critical that seniors get tested, know your, you know, know your, know, you, know, know, your, status, know your, yeah. status, know your and status. And that's June 29th, 8.30 at Care South Medical. That's right. 8.30 to 10.30. We okay. have senior hours. So nobody oh, okay. is there but the seniors. Okay. So go ahead. Start tomorrow. 60 and over. 60 and over. Line up, get in line, go ahead and get your test, and let's get this done. I think they're going to do it tomorrow and Tuesday, right? And and Wednesday. Okay. Right. And thank you, Carousel, for partnering with thank the agency to um, to do this drive-through COVID testing. Right. Um, it's very, very important that it our is. senior citizens know your status. That's right. That's right. Because, let's talk about COVID. Do you know that there is an increase? Mm. What you, You've been seeing it, Doc? Yeah, I've been hearing about it and reading about it and seeing it, yeah. And uh, we, the governor declared that we will remain in phase two for another 28 days. Yeah. And in order to, for us to, to stop this curve, we're going to have to do some due diligence. We're, everybody's going to have to have a mask on. Everybody. And stay six feet apart. Everybody. And stop congregating. Yep. You're going to have to stop walking around. Look, stop hanging out. A little 28 days of inconvenience can stop the spread. Yeah. 
and save lives and save some lives yeah, and so, save some lives and and I'm just not understanding you know I I, I read and hear about uh, groups who are against the mask and against sheltering in place and I'm not understanding the rationale are these people just not pro-life or they not do they, do they not care about life you know um, how could you oppose the mayor or the governor or anyone that says wear a mask stay six feet away you know this is about keeping people healthy and alive and so we should be willing to do whatever my question is when did the mask get so political right because, that's what i'm saying because yeah. here's what i know because we have lost quite a few seniors because of covid or they'll say because of the um complications complications you know so it might have been pneumonia or it might have been some heart mm -hmm, complications mm -hmm. well you know if they never had the virus they would have never gotten in pneumonia in the right, first place exactly. but because of the complications well you know what they never do, they, they never say mm. that miss so-and-so was a republican Right. Or Miss So and So was a Democrat, right. or Miss Mr. So and So was an Independent. Right. So what? Ask me this: How did the mask become such a political uh, issue? Question. Question of the day: Why is the mask wearing a mask so political? Why is it a debate? What is wrong with the mask? Tell us why. What is wrong with wearing the mask? If you're out there and you oppose wearing the mask, post on here and tell us why make wearing the mask so political. Right. Okay. It's easy. It's, it's affordable. That's right. It's not really an inconvenience. We gave out 15,000 of them for free. They were wow. free. So exactly. it's beyond affordable. Exactly. So, you know, let's just wear our masks when we're out in public. Now, I know um, it could be, for me, I wear glasses. Mm -hmm. And it, it, it's a perfected science to wear that mask and not fog your glasses. You gotta Very get, hard. You got to tuck it under, right? I wear glasses. And strap too. it on the ears just right. right. Then put your little crack so you can come under the bottom of this right. area here. Right. But other than that, what is the big deal? Right. Because, you know, uh, the mayor. somebody told you to do it. Right. The mayor posted or she made an announcement that, um, you know, there's a you can now call and report businesses where, where you go and the um, cashiers or the workers or whomever or not wearing masks, but be, you can now report businesses. And there are some folks who posted some really ugly things about <clears> that. <throat> about the mayor. About, that. about the mayor saying, you know, let let her office know if there's a business that you walk in that is non-compliant with wearing masks and protecting what, your safety. What, What's wrong Okay, with that? well, that's another question for me because mm -hmm. I, I, I walked into a business and, and here's, here was the perplexing thing to me. Everybody at the business had on masks. Everybody else didn't, Did. except me and the person that we walked in together. Right. I said, and so nobody the customer, in with a mask. So the customer's not wearing masks, but the, but the right. employees Right, so who are. is really being protected? Right, I mean, right, that's just, right, you right. Know, I'm gonna tell you, they talk about uh, Mayor Cantrell. She she throwing down the gauntlet, yeah. and she does not care. You gonna wear these masks, period, or, or you gonna or have we, a problem? Or we find or be up to a thousand dollars, or we shut down. Wear your mask, people. I wear mean, it's mask. it's ample out there. I keep them in my car. You know. Um, just, just wear your mask. Let's try to stop the spread of this virus. That's right. Do you know, James, that in our in globally, nearly ten million people have uh, have contracted this virus. Ten million. In the United States, there have been over two million people wow. with the virus in in the U.S. One hundred twenty-five thousand plus deaths in the U.S. Wow. Right here in Baton Rouge, yesterday, fourteen hundred and sixty-seven people with the virus. Nine new deaths. And 15 more hospitalizations yeah. right here in Baton Rouge. Today alone, 100. And, yesterday, 130 new cases. Yesterday, wow. In East Baton Rouge, we are among the top in this in the state. East Baton Rouge Parish. Yes, it's 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 Orleans, Jefferson, then us, then, us. then Caddo. It's ridiculous, and yeah. we can do so much better. Yeah, seniors, protect yourselves. Shelter at home. And for the and, and seniors who have grandkids and kids, tell them don't come to your house. Don't come to your house. Go eat where you've okay. been at. Yes, exactly. Temporary <laughs> sacrifice. That's right. Um, for longevity in life. Temporary right. sacrifice for longevity in life. Everybody deserves a chance to live as long as we can live. And so okay. we can help somebody else not die of this COVID virus. Wear your mask. Just as, as of today, there have been three thousand eighty-six deaths across our state. Three thousand. You know. And, and currently, there's 715 people still in the hospital. Mm -hmm. 76 people still on ventilators. Wow. And we can we can do so much better. And and I just don't understand. I don't understand what the big deal is. Right. And I, I was watching. Um. You know, I'm, I'm a big news head. I love. Uh, a couple. Oh, of I know you're a big news head because I get the text messages. <laughs> I, no, Tasha, I haven't watched that. I haven't read that. 
It just came out five <laughs> minutes ago. I haven't looked at it. Yeah. But this one doctor said, in order to solve the economic crisis, you have to solve the health crisis first. Mm -hmm. So we can't fix the economy till we get this health crisis in order. You got to double down on prevention and public health. These issues have to be resolved now before the fall comes and a possible second wave and the flu compiles that. Yes. Now, you know, my seniors can't take that kind of pressure. They can't. James, I can't take it. I, and so, you know, the, Tim say, I'm tripping. I'm yeah. tripping, you all in the air about this virus, but I mean it. Stop running around, infecting people. I walked in the absent, I was going to pick up my little medicine. I take my potassium. Mm -hmm. I went in there, the first person I saw with no mess, I turned around, I said, I ain't going. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to send Adam back. And they're so overcrowded. <laughs> Some of these stores are so overcrowded they sometimes. Are. And yeah. to those stores that are out there that are offering like early morning options for senior citizens to come and shop, thank you for that. That's okay, right. and let's That's respect right. that. You know, if 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 there's a grocery store, and I don't want to name any names on, on the radio until they they become sponsors, like high name, like okay, yeah, or, or partners, <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, but if you got hours where people can come in there that are senior citizens and shop. Let's respect mm -hmm. that and let the seniors have their hour or two of shopping That's right. free from a lot of us that may be younger and even immune systems that can maybe fight this disease. Let's give our senior citizens a chance to live. You know, the late, great Kathleen ba Governor, Kathleen Babino Blanco, uh, she said one time to me and others when we were talking about solutions to poverty, I is that, that sick people That's right. uh, can't earn and can't learn. That's right. In other words, you know, with this virus, can't nobody go to work and make a living That's right. if you're sick. So That's let's. Right. So in order to fix the economy, we got to heal ourselves. We can't be sick That's trying right. to go to work. You, and our children can't go to school if they're sick. That's right. So everybody's just wondering, well, when, what, what's going to happen in the fall? What's going to happen with, you know, with colleges and with K through 12? And how are we going to play football? We won't have the problem if we heal. And then, and no, we got to heal. And James, you know the number one question I'm getting? Hmm. When we're going to open the senior centers? centers. <laughs> when you, we tired of this, we want to come to the senior centers. Right, center. right. And, and I'm I want sure you what to you come. tell them. What do you tell them though? Well, not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Because I got to protect your health. Yeah, yeah. Not right now. Don't make, because you know, the seniors are the vulnerable population. Right. You know, now I gotta say they're doing better. Mm -hmm. I have seen less seniors walking around mm -hmm. with masks, but I still see some. Mm -hmm. Now, seniors, if you know a senior that don't have a mask, gonna rat them out. Let's yeah. put their name. We're gonna snap. We're gonna we're gonna snitch on them. Yeah, exactly, exactly. And get them a mask. <laughs> and get them a mask. <clears throat> if they need a mask, they can call him. Because we'll you have some here. Yeah, I yeah, have yeah. It for seniors. I don't have it for you. Right. For your grandkids <laughs> right. who not listening. Right. But I have masks for seniors. If you need a mask, call me. If Tim, we're not giving Tim any more masks, but I got it. <laughs> Senior citizens, Senior you need citizens, a mask, call, call the council on aging. 923 okay? for masks. Absolutely, absolutely. That's right. So before we go to our, our, new, our, break, our first break, topic of the day, how to stay healthy when you're over a certain age. Now, mm -hmm. this can, can apply to me because I'm about to make a big birthday. When is your, when is your birthday? Ooh, in July. Oh, wow. I'm feeling it too. I'm no. feeling myself. You're I'm looking to, good. You're looking I'm, good. My birthday's about to start with a five. <laughs> <laughs> James, You're looking good. I'm about, I'm about to start with a five. You're baby. looking good. You know, so I, I, this, I, we need to, we're going to talk about these tips. We're going to so, do it before the break? Or? Yeah, let's do it before the break. Okay. Then we're right. going to give them something away. Let me see. Uh, let, yeah, let's, let's talk about let's, what the giveaway is. Let's talk about the giveaway. Let's talk about yeah. what these are. Because I don't have one and I... Okay. Stay tuned to the show. Stay tuned to the this show. This entire so show these because are, here's what we're giving away. What are these, James? These are mobile devices for your home, senior citizens, That's to help right. you access the internet, to help you search the internet, to help you communicate, uh, called Google Home. That's right. One for you, and they're hands free, and you can put one in your room, one in the kitchen, one for the, look. It can control and you talk it. To it. You, you talk, talk to, to it. it. You don't have to touch anything. All you have to say is, "Hey Google, tell Alexis to cut um Marvin Gaye on for me, cause you know, let's get it on, right? right? <laughs> or tell uh, tell Alexis to, to cut the air down, mm -hmm. cut the lights off. Then you don't have to clap on and yep. clap off, cause this will do it. Or tell her to cut my tablet on yep. and cut my charge my phone up. This this one go in the room. You can play music in the room. You can even tell this thing to put you on eHarmony or Christian Mingus. Or, or, or to call your granddaughter. Or call your no. or call your call your daughter. Find me a senior companion. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So we're giving away these for free. And we have four of them. So you got to stay four. tuned to the show. Now, if you're listening on Facebook, start clicking. Let us see you listening. Hit the like button. Let me see you hit the like button yes. so we can know that you're paying attention, that you're listening. If you have some questions or comments on Facebook, let me know. If you want to be on ChristianMingle.com and you want this thing to find you a companion, <laughs> somebody put some hearts up there. Because, look, my, my, my grandmama used to t- tell me, I'm old, I ain't cold, right? <laughs> so I didn't know what that meant for a long time, but I got it now. <laughs> well, and that's what you do. With, with, your, with, your, with your programs, you give seniors opportunity right. to engage. Because you've always said and that about the research that shows that's that right. seniors that are engaged with that's other right. seniors and activities live longer. That's right. And have a better quality of life. And so since we have this pandemic right now, and a lot of you all are sheltering at home, mm-hmm. the Council on Aging is giving away devices that's right. that Technology. can help you still stay in contact that's with right. people. That's right. You can still connect with, with your us. peers and, right. and the agency. Because yeah. you can tell this to cut on the uh, Council on Aging website right. mm-hmm. because we're about to do exercise with Leslie right, right, and Donald, right, right. and that's coming soon. Free gift. So you're giving away Free four gifts. of them? We're giving away four of these today. Okay. And then we're also going to talk about the rules of engagement for Lotus Zone Bingo. Right. Next week, we're going to do Lotus Zone Bingo. So we're about to go to break, and then we're going to call. You know what? When we come out of the break, let's get this little one okay. away for the room. We're going to start with the little one first. Okay. When we come from break, we're going to want call a number. What number you five. like? Five. Call a number five. After break. After break. After break. Three, eight, nine. Three, nine, two, nine. three. Nine, two, three. Eight thousand. Eight thousand. Extension three five nine. I don't start calling until after the break now. Don't call right now. <laughs> nine two three eight thousand. Go, Trudy, to the break. All right, Facebook. Okay, Facebook. Tim, your mama said come to her house as soon as you get from here. If you have any questions or anything you want to talk about, start posting them on Facebook. Let us know. If you want to learn more about this technology that we'll be giving away after the show, let us know. This is great technology for seniors in their homes. That's right. Okay. And if look, even if you're not a senior and you're listening and you want to um, get one of these for your 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 loved one, we can tell you how to get it. So they're, they're very, they're relatively, you know, affordable. Affordable. You can get a couple of these for your loved one. Hands-free technology is what you need nowadays because. You That's know, right. if you're sheltered at home or if you, if you can't access your your, seat, your grandmother or your, right. or whomever, hands-free technology. That's right. I, Absolutely. I'm going to get one because I want to I wanna tell it, uh, Alexis, tell Adam to go get me some water. <laughs> <laughs> you think I could make it do that? Uh, make Adam get the water or make <laughs> Alexa? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for tuning into the show every Tuesday and Sunday at 4 p.m. At 4 p.m. The Lotus Zone. The Lotus Zone. Latest information to help support senior citizens, right. to help improve their quality of life. And it's not just for senior citizens. It's for all of us that may have a senior citizen in our life that we care for. And so tune in every Tuesday and, and Sunday at 4 p.m. right here on Lotus Zone, brought to you by the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging. That's right. And 106.1 FM. And our sponsor. Oh, yeah, yeah. Care South. Care South. Paying for this. Yes. Thank you, Care South. <laughs> Thank you, Care South. For being a great And if anybody else out there want to be a sponsor, that's right. Give us a call. We're you looking want, for sponsorships look, for the show. If you just want to give away something to the seniors, mm-hmm. call and ask for our executive boss producer, Trudy. Yes. So that's something you want to give away or promote. Jimmy uh, and Ma Catering. Oh, yeah. They're a sponsor. They're a sponsor. Oh, okay. Thank you, Jimmy look, and Ma. And you talking about Miss Ma got the best peach cobbler peach game cobbler, in town. Peach cobbler, yes. Yes. The best peach cobbler in town. Thank you, Jimmy and Ma, for being She's going to be back sponsor. up and running in August, and we first. Yes, yes. catering yep. services. Mr. Ernest Stevens, he bought the tablets for technology, too. So he's, a former, Ernest, he's a former, former board, board chair. chair. Mm-hmm. Mr. Ernest mm-hmm. Stevens, that's right. Thank you, Mr. Right. Stevenson, for the for the uh, sponsorship. That's right, that's right. Chef Celeste. Oh, Chef Celeste yeah. last week, last week, steaks. Attorney Joel Porter. Okay. Attorney Joel Porter. Thank you, Attorney Joel Porter. He's not on Joel Facebook, Porter. but he know everything on the internet. Yeah, he says he's not media. on Facebook. But, but he stops. We know you're watching us, Joel he's Porter. He's a lurker. We know, you, <laughs> we know you're watching us. We know you're watching us. And Leggett Construction. Yeah. yeah Leggett Speaking construction. of construction, again, stay tuned to the end of the show. If you want to update 
on all the construction projects. I know y'all saw the fire station and the admin building. If you want an update on all the construction projects, you gotta tune in. The last few minutes of the show, the CEO will be giving the public an update on all the great construction projects That's it. that wouldn't be possible if it wasn't for the taxpayers of East Baton Rouge Parish. Exactly right, Dr. Yeah, Dillon. right, right. Wouldn't be possible. That's it. And when we get back off from the break, oh, okay, Miss I- Dorothy Jackson. She on. She is on with us. Tim, you got She's a own. member of your, uh, you your board. You got a coupon from Forever 21. <laughs> how you doing, uh, attorney? Hey, hey Jackson. Dr. Jackson, how you doing? Thank That's you for it. your support. Being on the board. That's right. That's yeah. right. You may want to. That might be a great topic, also, to have a legal, a legal session, a show on legal, legal talk about. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. Yeah, that'll be a great topic. Uh-huh. <laughs> We're gonna have to ask the doctor. Ask the lawyer. Yeah, ask the lawyer. Ask, ask the, the doctors. doctors in a little bit. Yeah, yeah. That's coming soon. Topic. Ask the doctors. Ask the, <laughs> <laughs> ask the doctors. It's coming soon. <laughs> That's the doctor. Oh, right. I just love y'all so much. <laughs> Don't nobody have as much fun on their radio show as Thank we you, do. Okay? That's right. You right about it. You right about it. <laughs> hey, sis. Oh, it's not, okay. All right, look. Are we coming back? We're about to give this away. We're about to give this away. Cut that off. All right, all right. Welcome back to the Lotus Zone. We're looking for. Caller number five. Y'all, I'm going to kill Dr. Gilmore. Caller, caller number, number five. five. Caller number five. We're looking for caller number two, five. 225 extension 359. Say it again, Doc. Slower for the seniors. 225 extension 359. Call in right now to win this home mini Google Alexa. This the one for the bedroom. Free technology for you. You must be a senior citizen to win. That's right. Nine two three eight thousand extension three five nine. Caller number five, Will. You are caller number one. Please hang up and call again. Okay. Nine two three eight thousand extension three five nine. Nine two three eight thousand extension three five nine. If you want to win this technology, give us a call. You are caller number two. Please hang up and call again. You are caller number three. Please hang up and try again. You are caller number four. Hang up and try again. There it is. Hello, this is the Lotus Zone. Who am I speaking with? Heldon Sheets. That's A-G-E-T-S. Heldon? Hilda, H-I-L-D-A. Hilda Sheets. Hi, Miss Sheets. How are you? I'm, I'm number three. You number five. You won. I'm number five. You number yeah. five. Yes, it did. Miss Sheets, Miss Hilda Sheets. Look, all you need to do is you you can come to the main office at 5790 Florida Boulevard. Wait a minute, Miss Sheets. Are you a senior? Yes, ma'am. I'm 85. Ooh, oh wow! What a blessing! Uh, what a well, you, blessing! You, you go to the Perkins Road Senior Center. Well, all right, Miss Sheets. We're telling she has well, something you got new the, for her you house. You got something new for your house, the Google Mini Home. And look, you can tell it to tell somebody to do something for you. <laughs> you can tell you can it to get to online. It. You can talk to it. And, it, and, and it'll and it do everything you needed to do. Okay, now where do I have to go? To the main office, 5790 Florida Boulevard. i tell you what I'm going to do. Since you go, do you pick up your lunch at Perkins? I can. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm gonna have the I'm gonna I'm gonna have the driver to deliver this to the Perkins Road Senior Center, so you don't have to drive over here. And we'll put your name on it, and you can pick it up right there at your senior center when you pick your lunch okay. up. All right. Okay. And Monday, I think I can do it. Or? Yes, ma'am. You can pick it up Monday for lunch. Okay. Congratulations. Well, Congratulations, Miss Sheets. All right, Miss Sheets. Okay. Bye-bye. Congratulations. Bye-bye. Oh. State Representative C. Denise Marshall has joined us uh, on Facebook Live. Hey, Rep. How you Marcel, doing, board how you member? Doing? That's our vice chair right yeah. there. All right, Miss Hilda Sheets. Congratulations, Miss Hilda first Sheets. Win, our first yeah, win. Yeah, absolutely. But stay stay with us now because uh, we'll be giving away more senior technology. Te- more, technology more. that seniors can use 
in their home. So stay tuned uh, for the remainder of the show so that you'll know when you can dial in to win. Okay, now Dr. Gilmore, let's yeah. talk about, let's give them some tips on how to stay healthy. Healthy. During these pandemic times. I'm gonna let you lead this off, you know. Well, first of all, family. during this time, we all gotta take care of our mental health. That's right, that's first okay? and foremost. Because once the mind is gone, the body is soon to follow. So that's we right. gotta take care of our mental health. Um, you know, seniors, if you're dealing with any stress or depression, um, if you got any life changing uh, experiences that you're dealing with that might be causing you anxiety, um, you may you may want to seek out assistance. That's right. Okay, give the counseling agent a call. You talk to call, your care manager. Call your, your care manager worker. or your social worker here at the counseling on aging. Give a family member a call. Give a your spiritual advisor, your pastor a call. Seniors, don't allow your mental health to deteriorate because once the mind is gone the body is soon to follow That's right. and so it's very important during this pandemic especially for those scenes that might be experiencing depression or suicidal thoughts uh, there's a number I'm going to give you that you can call if you are a senior citizen that may be experiencing depression or suicidal thoughts I want you to dial 1-800-273-8255 if you are a senior experiencing depression or suicidal thoughts, call the National Suicide Prevention Hotline at 1-800-273-8255. But also, you know, always feel free to call here, 923-8000, and your care manager will definitely provide you with the assistance. That's right. Again, number one, take care of your mental health, seniors. And, and Dr. Gilmore, you know, there's a, it's, you can always call on Jesus, too. Always, always. You can always. always call on him. Prayer. He, he, prayer. Prayer works. Yep, having strong faith. Strong faith. Yep. That's mm -hmm. right. You can have strong faith. What faith else they got? Without works. The next one. You now, see, why you give this to me? <laughs> <laughs> you know, he trying to keep going. The next one is eating right. That's right. Okay? That's why, right. Uh, you, you, I, I should have done <laughs> mental health. You are, You're going to look over here at me. <laughs> And say, what else we got? <laughs> why, why you get this to me? Eating healthy. Okay, go yeah. ahead and talk about that. Okay, now you eat healthy, Tasha. I'm around you a lot. On some days. You eat salads. You eat a lot of salads. Uh, you have to say I eat a lot. <laughs> <laughs> we, you know. Okay. So seniors, you got to take care of your That's diet, right. okay? Take care of your diet. Now, again, Ms. Amar, she knows the guidelines, the nutritional guidelines, like the back of her hand. Because every day she cooks meals for thousands of seniors. So if you're eating from the Council on Aging, right. you're already getting the That's basic right. minimal nutritional healthy guidelines. Because what y'all do, milk, 2% milk, milk y'all get your bread, you get, you get your, your vegetables, meat, you your get starch, your, your four, four ounces of protein. You get the best meal of the day comes from the Council on right. Aging. Right. So, 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 so you're already eating healthy if you're eating right. here at, with the Council on Aging. But let's say you're you're a senior that's not participating with the Council on Aging, or let's say that um, you, you know you, you you don't have after you have our meals, what should you do? You got to find a way to stay eating healthy. So what that means is you know you can't have a lot of salt. Um, you got to you know the you know you can't do the sodas and the candy. Okay, right. the right. sugar and fat is not good for you, seniors. Yes. Okay, the sugar and fat is not good for you. Um, you got to get your protein, seniors. Mm -hmm. You got to get your proteins in your eggs and your almonds and That's your right. chicken breasts and your oats. Okay. And your whole grains. And your whole greens and your vegetables. Fish. Yes, you got to get that. And also, let me tell you, there's a reason why they call it H2O. We need oxygen to live. That's right. Seniors, you got to drink your, your water. That's right. You got to drink your fluids. Um, especially with, you know during this pandemic, you gotta you gotta stay hydrated. That's right. So so and you can't right. hydrate with just beer either. No, yeah, not just beer. Okay, <laughs> that's right. Not just beer. So seniors, because you got a senior that they loves like beer. beer. Okay. Know. In fact, I posted something on Facebook of a picture of a pig lip and some potato chips, uh -huh. and and the question was, what do you eat with pig lip and potato chips? And one of your seniors posted <laughs> on my Facebook page a, a cold beer. <laughs> Okay, our cold beer. That's right. That's okay, right. so not just beer. You mm -hmm. got to drink your water too, senior. So that's lots right. of water, uh, mm -hmm. uh, lots of fruits and vegetables, and whole grains and fish and chicken breast. Who picked this? Who picked this topic so, today? So, so, so should I? Truth is, what you trying to give me some subliminal message? Next is exercise. 
<laughs> now you sponsor an exercise program. I so, do. So you know, even though you you may not get a chance to exercise every day because she's working hard for you all seniors, so it's hard to fit exercise in her schedule. Tell them about the exercise programs and what you do here to keep your seniors healthy. Well, we do now. Seriously, we have uh, senior aerobics, mm-hmm. chair aerobics, tai chi, tai chi for arthritis. We're gonna start meditation, meditating. Mm-hmm. We're gonna do all this virtually online. Um, we have we have fitness instructors. We do line dances. We were doing that. We're gonna do. We're gonna pick all these activities up here shortly online, where they can log in collectively and we can see them in the room and they can mm-hmm. see the you YouTube know what? And Facebook. YouTube and Facebook and I might come from my desk and get on some of these okay you know my birthday my number is gonna start with the five, five soon. Soon. in the name of and, Jesus and, and, yes. yes and so I gotta stop running from it I've been fluffy all my days maybe I'll try the other side <laughs> This after 50. So exercise, <laughs> exercise is very important. Seniors, That's right. Okay, do some kind of movement in your home. Mm-hmm. Um, um, if, if you're if you're sheltering at home right now, we, we do don't yoga, have seniors, seniors. yoga. Yeah, and some and here some of those things that we where we were doing here at the council agent before the pandemic, That's seniors right. that you were participating in, you should know how to do them at your house now. Right. Okay, That's so. Right. You know, we have activities here at the Council on Aging, mm-hmm. but now that we're sheltered in place, seniors do those same things that, that they taught you right. at your home. You and know? starting up next week, Amanda is going to put all our videos in one location on the website. So when if the senior would like, they can go right there. there. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm behind. They are already there. One location on the website, you can click on. If you want to look at Leslie, look at Leslie. You okay. Look at Brock, look at Brock. You can go and click on them and, and, and take the classes at your leisure when you get ready mm-hmm. um but make sure you you participate uh in the classes there are on the website i can do this next okay one. gotcha so okay right, or what you got get seven <laughs> to nine hours of sleep <laughs> you need to get seven to nine hours of sleep because you know sleep repairs the body and oh, wow. it re- and it fuels the mind Oh, wow. It repairs your body and it fuels your mind. And seniors, and then like you, not sleeping in between the young and the restless mm-hmm. and bold and the beautiful. Right, not naps. Not naps. Not cat naps. Not cat naps. Yeah. Lay down, cut your TV off, cut the noise off, and go to sleep. And what it does is, they say it, um, it repairs damage to your cells and it refreshes your immune system. Wow. So you got to get the proper amount of sleep and it prevents you from getting sick and needing to go to the doctor that's so awful. often. Okay. That's so right. Sleep is very mm-hmm. healing. That's right. Yeah. That's Get right. your sleep seniors. Get your sleep. And they told me, my doctor told me the other day, if I go to sleep I won't be so hungry. Oh, I don't wow. know if the, I'm just kidding. Jack. Oh <laughs> I was about to say <laughs> But it's okay. They say it's okay too to not be a morning person. Because if you don't have to get up to go to work, you know, it's okay to not be a morning person. As long as you're getting enough sleep. But if you have to go to work, mm-hmm. that's not going to work for truth. She got to get up, yep. come to work. She's not a morning person. Mm-hmm. You got to get up and come to work. So Learning. Yeah, learning. Here's another thing. Seniors, it's never too late to learn. You should learn something every day. That's why we're doing this technology. Not mm-hmm. only is it for your connectivity to us, to stay connected to us, but you get to learn some stuff. This is new to you. It's new to me. Let's learn together. Learning will help you keep your mind sharp. It slows memory loss. If you reach a, a certain age, it helps you keep your brain active. Wow. It helps you keep actively engaged. It helps you keep all your functions your firing off. So, yeah. you know, this kind of stuff helps you learn. Technology Tuesday is for you to learn and keep your cognitive uh Going, brain cells. Brain cells and if you going. don't have technology, then everybody has books. And if you don't have books, we can get you some books. Well, one Reading thing I know, is very good. Well, I, one book I know every senior has. Every senior. We the know. good book. Yes. It's on the nightstand. Yes. It's Read the good it. book. Read, Read it. it. That's learning. That's that's keeping your brain cells mm-hmm. alive. So seniors, don't ever stop learning. Um, um, don't ever stop reading. And if you're having difficulty to go to going to sleep, insomnia. Pick up the good book. It'll put you to sleep. Yeah. Don't know about nothing. Put you to sleep faster than yeah. the Bible. I'm mm-hmm. trying to tell you. <laughs> Soothes your brain. <laughs> It'll put you to sleep. Real Soothes your brain. Quick. All right. How about take care of your skin, Doctor? No, Gilmore? that's you. No, come on. Seniors, you. you can be prone. Seniors are prone to skin infection. Did you know? And disease, and their skin can be thinner, drier, less responsive. Uh, they lose sweat and oil through the glands, so it's pro- you need to make sure you moisturize, and not with just Vaseline. Yeah. You know, seniors will leave just rub Vaseline everywhere. Mm-hmm. No, 
You could get you some good lotion, cocoa some butter, cocoa some butter, lotions. some shea butter. Yeah. Wash yeah. your face with black oil. Okay. Yep. Yeah. With black uh, soap, black sea okay. soap. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, that's good for your for your skin. Uh, skin cancer is super common, you know what, particularly let's, in let's, our area. Let's give away some skin skin products. Let's do that. Yeah. Let's some do it. Some black soap or whatever. Yeah. Let's yeah. give away some, some skin shea products. Some shea butter and some coconut. I think our seniors would appreciate some skin products. You gonna donate? Yeah. yeah. I'll okay. donate some skin products. Hey, we got yeah. new donations. So next Sunday we'll be giving away some skin, skin products. products. Some seniors. Yeah. Some seniors. Mm-hmm. Some, for some, some shea seniors. butter. Yeah. Cocoa butter to put on your feet at the back part. You know where it's real right. hard yeah. at. Mm-hmm. That's right. Mm-hmm. And the bottom. And the bottom. And it's, it, try to avoid direct sunlight as much as possible. And you ought not be going out unless you have a mask on. Right. Did we already talk about we are, that? Well, we can never talk about that too much. <laughs> and then no, stop smoking. Uh-oh. It causes cancer. It can cause wrinkles and dental hygiene issues. If you're Uh-oh. smoking, it's time to quit. Quit smoking. Quit smoking, seniors. Quit smoking, seniors. Say no to cigarettes, seniors. It can cause right. a lot. What did you say? It can cause cancer. It can uh, cause cancer. cancer. Dental hygiene Dental issues. problems. And uh, extra wrinkles that you ain't have to yeah, get. Yeah, no, seniors, we don't want you to get wrinkle up. We want That's you to right. stay regal and beautiful. Okay? That's right. Stay regal so, and beautiful. So, uh, and so smooth skin. Smooth skin. That's so right. So cut, cut out the smoking, seniors. Now, seniors, I, listen, I'm going to tell you, I didn't write this article. This came from AARP. Excellent. It's a good article. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The next one, seniors, now if you hear this and if you agree with it, click the like button. Have a lot of sex. Seniors, Ooh. if you think having a lot of sex... Is good in your senior age. Let oh us know. God. Post post some comments. No, please. Do you agree with <laughs> having sex? Because Don't research shows that seniors that have sex have live a better longer. quality of life and live and longer. Listen, this thing says having sex is extremely beneficial to the mental and physical health. I, I don't think I want to know about seniors having a bunch of sex, but this is what it says. Research shows that. Now we also got a note now. Protected Safe sex. sex. That's right. All right, because mm-hmm. uh, senior population is one of the up and growing populations of STDs. That's right. Um, in in our parish, and so seniors, though it is proven to be healthy and improves your mental health and physical health to have sex, make okay. sure you protect yourself. This thing, keep te- keep your sex life creative as we yeah. age. Mm-hmm. It keeps close relationship with your significant other. Yes. Sometimes be. You know, make love making a challenge. Sex is a natural pain reliever. Yep, it says that. The research we, shows sex is a natural for seniors keeps, is a natural pain reliever. Natural pain reliever. Mm-hmm. It keeps passion and closeness alive. The they saying amen on Facebook. They, they saying amen. Oh, oh Lord, the seniors saying amen on Facebook. It also it also releases endorphins and dopamine mm-hmm. during sex for seniors. Dopamine is a, a neurotransmitter which awakes the award center part of your brain. So when you have sex, you get awarded in the brain. Yeah, you get excitement. And you got higher cognitive it, function. You get, you, get, you get excitement mentally. Oh, Lord. Okay. You have higher cognitive function, which can keep away dementia. Wow. Wow. So, see, so you can having have, sex as a senior can help prevent or keep away dementia. You know what? I ain't going to be able to go to my mom and daddy house for a while. <laughs> you know, there's some seniors that I, I'm not going to be able to. Sex is wonderful. So Somebody of our seniors sex are is wonderful. Okay. Okay. So again, just remember, you know, be safe Ooh. with it. Uh, be responsible with the seniors. But research proves that it's very beneficial in your senior age. That's what this art, this is from the AR, AARP. AARP, okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. And then get routine health, health screenings. screenings. If you feel healthy as a horse, it's important to get a routine checkup anyway. Yeah. Great ways to make sure you stay uh, you stay safe. And we're going to have that coming up once a week. We're going to have Ask the Doctor. Okay, Ask doctors. the Doctor. we got some doctors coming on who's going to answer good. some questions. And what are some health screenings that you think seniors should take? Ms. Make Amor? sure that they you have to get your mammogram. Okay. You know? So t- Okay, so that's okay. Uh, preventative checkups, gotcha. mam- mammogram, cholesterol. Check your prostate, Dr. Gilmore. Mm-hmm. Had that check once a year. Uh, diabetes check, liver function, and more. Yeah. So That's don't it. be afraid to go to the doctor seniors. Don't be afraid. Do, don't your, be afraid. do your checkups. Do your checkups. Yeah. And absolutely. have plenty of sex. So that's some great, great um, healthy tips for seniors. All right. And COVID-19 testing packets can be picked up right here at the main office. 
5790 Florida Boulevard. So you what are those packets for? That's your pre-registration package. Oh, I didn't go know get about your that. free test. Okay, so before you go to Care South right. on Monday That's at 8:30, right. you can swing you gotta by come by here and get a pack. If you don't have one already, okay. All right. and you can fill it out, and they'll, it, it's easier. It doesn't take so long, and you'll be in the system. They'll put it in, and you can get your test. Good. Now, Dr. Gilmore, let's take a pause for the call. Okay. Let's get this away. We're gonna give something away. Let's here. get a big one away. All right. It, it has a screen on it. A Google Home Hub. It's basically like a. It looks like your little, your swipe system at your senior center. That's what it looks like. Okay, mm -hmm. so you got a, you got a, some new technology that we're giving away to seniors right now. Read on the side to tell you what it does. Okay, it does your calendar. I ain't <laughs> it, get a number yet, y'all. It does your calendar. It helps uh, find places in your area. So if you say Google, help me find the dry cleaner. Google, help me find a certain street. Um, it could. It could have a camera at your front door. Mm -hmm. You can you have YouTube on here so they can watch your videos That's right. and your radio show. It has music on here so you can tell it to play music. It you makes hand-free calls. Yeah, you can tell it to give you re certain recipes. Um, and it cuts photos. your TV on. It cuts your TV on and off. Um, it plays your favorite songs. That's right. Um, it's got Bluetooth on it. It has Bluetooth which allows it to be hand-free. You can control your TV, your lights, your camera. So this is some what great technology. Uh, Since so they already called, let's go with caller number seven. Seven. You already got them calling right now. All right, let's see. Call let's see. We seven. can do let's seven. Yeah. Okay. Caller call number, number seven. seven. Let's see. You're calling number one. Keep calling. Keep calling. Nine two three eight thousand extension three five nine. You're we are giving this two. away. You're calling number Google three. Google technology hub nine two three eight thousand. You're calling number. Th Three. Extension Four. 359. I'm jacking this phone up today. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> Hello, you're calling number five. 923 8000, extension 359. Hello, you're calling number six. Call back. We're giving away technology here. Whew. One more, one more. There it is. Hello, who am I speaking with? Exactly. Hey, Miss Chambers, are you a senior? Of course I am. Miss Chambers, you are calling number seven. <laughs> congratulations. You, congratulations, Miss Chambers. You just won the Google Home Find Your New Boyfriend machine. <laughs> <laughs> My husband probably wouldn't like that. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> well, find a vacation spot find for you and your husband. <laughs> tell, Google Chrome is going to tell your husband to go get you some water. <laughs> Yeah, you can give him instructions on it. <laughs> okay, Miss Chambers, you can pick this up at 5790 Florida Boulevard. Tomorrow, we have it at the front desk for you. Okay, thank you. So and, and thank you for listening. Congratulations. Thank you. All right, bye-bye. Outstanding. Bye -bye. Council on Aging, giving away technology to our seniors. That's right. At the most pressing time where many of our seniors are sheltered at home and can't get out of their homes now they can use this technology to to engage one another to engage the council on aging to learn different things to surf the internet um to so thank you council on aging for giving away technology to and our seniors thank you to our sponsors okay, who are helping yeah, us yeah. buy these items because mm -hmm. uh, you know the budget is tight yeah. right now so dr gimmo let's talk about uh is it break time trudy or we're gonna talk we're gonna talk about some other things. Okay. What she say? We're gonna to go to a short break. break. Well, then we're gonna talk about the brick campaign, and we're gonna talk about radio bingo, Lotus Zone radio bingo. Wow, y'all! We're, we're, we're about to go play some bingo, play bingo through the radio. Starts on Tuesday. Starting Tuesday. Starts on Tuesday. Wow, that's gonna be exciting. Our first prize on the bingo day is fifty-five inch TV. Yes. 55. Let's Our seniors love TV. television. 65, 65. They make them that big? Yeah. Oh, wow. Our seniors love television. Whole living room. 65 inch TV. You hear that, Miss Pratt? We're going to upgrade the uh, television. Miss Pratt. 65 inch TV. <laughs> So we'll be back after the break to Mr. learn Paris about the brick to learn about the brick program after the break. That's um it. and about the bingo. That's about right. the bingo after the break. All righty. Fix this. It's too low. He's just See moving down on his own. This. Fun. That was a lot of fun. They call it Tasha for the technology. I like that song. 
Yes, indeed. Facebook. Okay. This Thank you, everybody, Facebook, for tuning in. Keep tuning in. All right, the third one. You put the other ladies up. You can't see me? You have your... Uh... Where the other one, Tink? All right, this third small one is going to go to a Facebook winner. All right, let's ask a question on okay. Facebook. Facebook, and on the if you're looking on, if you're watching on the website, you're going to win this one. Facebook right. only. Facebook, Facebook viewers will give you the exclusive opportunity to win something right now. That's right. Now, make sure you like the East Baton Rouge Council on Agent page. You might be watching from my page, or you might be watching from the council page. Make sure you like the East Baton Rouge Council on Agent page. All right. So, we're going to ask a quick question. Let's come up with a question we can ask. And then the first person who answers the question right will win the mini home one for their room. What we're going to ask? A good question might be, what year was the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging established? Use Google, call a friend, but tell us what year the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging was established, and you win this technology. No, Judy. Who? Anybody? Anybody? Post it. Anything? Anybody? 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 That's it. What year was the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging on established? And you can win this Facebook. This Facebook. is only for you. If you can tell us what year the Council on Aging was established, you win this Google Put it up there. Home Dude. Mini. Okay, go to our website. Go to our website for that answer. Come on, Facebook. What year was the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging established? No hits. You gotta. It's on our website. They're gonna, they're gonna keep looking, Tim. Tim, what do you got? 1973. Who, yep, that's it. Who is that? Mary Ann Hawkins. Miss Mary Ann Hawkins. You win, Miss mm -hmm. Mary Ann Hawkins. Congratulations, Miss Hawkins. Miss Hawkins, you, you win, Miss Hawkins. She 1973. 1973. Miss Hawkins. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, Miss Hawkins. Put Miss Hawkins' name on this. You know where to get it at, Miss Hawkins. That's a great gift. Mm hmm. We got one left, right? Hmm? Yeah, you get a, a way to end of the show? Hmm? Yep. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. We'll get our way. What's the good question? We won't ask a question. Let me see, too. What question? Um. Yeah, we're gonna make a comment question from the end. That's okay. We didn't say it. But we'll say it on the next one. Um Oh, this is good. All right. We ready? You said two more minutes? Oh. All right. All right, all right, all right. All right. We're back. We look. Lotus zone, Lotus we're back zone. here. Every Tuesday and Sunday at 4 p.m., tune in to the Lotus Zone on Facebook Live or on 106.1 FM. Or catch it on the, on the website. Or on the website. www.ebrcoa.org. Where we talk about everything, senior citizens and That's more. Right. That's right. Yeah, yeah. But, James, mm -hmm. starting on Tuesday of this week, we got Technology Tuesday, but we also going to play Radio Bingo starts Radio at bingo. 4 o'clock. Look. One thing we know for sure is that senior citizens love some bingo. And I'm starting to love it too. I love it. I yeah. love bingo. We're going to well, have the bingo. You're turning that big, that big five, 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 five yeah. soon. So, so yeah. the older you get, the more That's you right. uh, love bingo. That's huh? right. I'm going to turn up like the young people say. I'm going to turn up. All right, look. It's, it's really got a one behind it. Oh, five, oh, yeah, I thought so. Points. Yeah, I You didn't thought so. Yeah. But look, okay, let's, all right. You look like you're 42. Okay, thank you, James. That's the fluffiness. All right. So Radio cuddly. B. You're so cuddly and 42. I'm so cuddly and fluffy. I'm like a cuddly bear. Okay. It's Miss Amar Cuddly, you all. It's Miss Amar Cuddly. We have the all most right. cuddly and beautiful CEO of the Council on Aging. That's it, that's it. Okay. okay. 
So here are the rules. Let's go over the rules. Okay, Trudy, for bingo. You got for bingo. She, the rules for bingo. First of all, turn to your rules. Okay, sheet. Got it. Rules. Lotus Zone host, which is me and whomever, mm -hmm. will be Tuesday at four. You have to be listening. We're gonna start this Tuesday, June the thirtieth. In order to play, you have to be sixty years old, age or older, and a uh, resident of EBR. We already started giving out the Lotus Zone bingo cards. Each card is different. If you haven't gotten your card, we're still giving them out Monday. I think it's the last group of millions. How are you giving them out? We've been delivering them at the senior centers, okay, gotcha. and there's some at the front desk, and there's some at. Uh, we've been taking them to the meals on wheels. To the homes, right? And there's some at the front desk. Right, Trudy? That's right. It will have some at the front desk. If you haven't gotten yours, you come to the front desk. But it's one card per person. One card per person. All right? You can pick up your card at the drive through lunches between 10 and 2. Pick mm -hmm. up your bingo card. All right. We're playing straight line bingo. Horizontal, vertical, diagonal, straight line. The first caller to call. <laughs> <laughs> diagonal. <laughs> The first caller to call into the line to, to our phone number with a good bingo wins the prize. Now, if we got two or three winners, whoever called first is the winner. Not We're not backing up. No, we splitting. We're not pulling the number. Whoever called first, you become the winner. winner. And you have 24 hours to claim your prize. First major prize is a big TV. Wow. I don't know what Tuesday, size. Tuesday, we're giving Tuesday. away a Tingo. Uh, tingo. <laughs> tingo. We're giving away a TV. A Tingo for with the bingo. Radio bingo. For radio bingo. <laughs> you have to have your ID. You got to, you have to make sure you, we got to make sure you're a member of the Council on Aging. So you got to fill out your membership. don't know how to become a member? Call us. Fill early. out your membership. Fill out your membership card. All it is is you got to be 18 and live in the parish. That's all you have to do. If you have difficulty with the phone phone line, eighteen. You call gotta be us. sixty. No, you could be no sixty to win, but oh. to be a member of the council on age, you'd be eighteen. Oh, okay. Yeah. So we need to start a campaign for uh for for young folks. Yeah, I didn't you know that. Be, you okay. could be eighteen and up to be a member. member of the council. But you got to be sixty, 60 and over to, to win. To get anything, you got to be sixty yeah, and over. Gotcha. That's right. That's right. All others are just a, a support group. That's right. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah. You just here to cheer on the seniors. Yeah. As a winner, you acknowledge that the Lotus Zone has the right. So without further authorization, we're going to be able to publish your name, your photograph, your voice, and the fact that you won. And you can win but once a month. Okay. Okay? So once a month. Because we got to give everybody a chance. And we have the right to end the game if it's some foolishness that kicks off because you know how y'all get some time. We don't want that. We're not about that trouble. If y'all start acting up about the prizes, we're going to we'll shut the shut game down. <laughs> you know we'll do it. It's no pur purchase necessary. This is for fun. And boy, we're prohibited. Now, so, good luck. So, we're going to send out these rules. Mm -hmm. We're going to send out the rules to everybody. We're going to put them on our pages. We're going to put them on the website so you can read them in advance. So, Tuesday, bingo. Come ready. Tuesday, we plan bingo Tuesday we at 4 o'clock here at the Council on Aging. All right. Now, now, quickly. Let's talk about the brick campaign. Because cause I'm excited. We got one more of these big, um, oh, okay. what you call it? Google. Technology, Google Home. Hub to give away. Hub. Call it number three. We're gonna we're gonna get it at the end of the game. Oh, okay. At all the right. end of okay. the show. All right. All right. And we, you know what, James? Because because Miss Mary, we we gave one of the other things away during the for Facebook. Let's just go ahead and give away a tablet too. Wow, we're giving today. away a tablet today, y'all. Giving away a tablet too. All right. Just because I, you know, I'm about to, I feel like it. Yeah. Let's just so it. let's talk about the brick campaign and your construction. Okay. So the brick campaign has been launched. If you would like to purchase a brick to support the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging's um, Intergenerational Center. If you haven't been there, come on, go on over to Gus Young Avenue. The old fire station is being renovated um, for the uh, Intergenerational Center. Um, Ms. Amar, yes. so if you want to buy a brick, call 9238000, but tell them about all the other construction projects okay, you quickly. have going on. We, we have, you know, we're we running out of time. Okay, we so you want to save the construction updates? We'll do it next week. Okay, you want to give away the prizes time. right now? Right, okay. Uh, they're already... time, they call and I didn't give them a number yet. So this is what we're going to do. Here's what, how we're going to do this. Call us number four and five. But call it number five is going to win the tablet. Call it number four is going to win the Google Hub. Call it number five, you have to... Okay, I'm call it number five. You have to answer the question. Here's the question. The question is, who was the first 
ever African American CEO or director or executive director of the East Baton Rouge Council on Aging. And if you can name that, you can win. On Facebook, call in to get the phone number 923 8000 359, extension 359, 923 8000, extension 359. I'm about to start answering. Call in number four, wins the hub. Call in number five, wins the tab. All let's right. Go. All right, let's see. Giving away some prizes. Thank you all for tuning in today. We enjoyed so we're giving you. away some prizes. Dr. Gilmore, you were fun today. This is really fun. 923 8000. I'm going to go home and exercise. 923 8000, <laughs> extension 359. You call the number one, hang up and try again. Miss Mary, did you just win something? <laughs> 923 8000, extension you are 359. Call the number two, hang up and try again. 923 8000, extension 359. You are caller number three, please hang up and try again. You are caller number four, who am I speaking with? I'm sorry, who? Jerome Dugas. Jerome Dugas. Mr. Dugas, are you a senior? Yes. All right. Do you go to one of the Do you go to one of the senior centers? All right. Well, look. Congratulations. Congratulations. You just run the Google Home Hub. You can come to the main office and pick it up on tomorrow. Congratulations. Congratulations. Keep tuning in. Which what'd you say? I did the tablet. No, you, no, you win the you tablet. Want, no, you won <laughs> you, you, you the hub. hub. You can talk to it. It's gonna do all types of things for you. Call the number five. You want to call the number four. Call the number five. Gotta win the hood. The tablet. Okay. Congratulations. Right. Congratulations. Don't be so all excited. Right. All now right. we're about to give away the tablet. Call number five. She said, I don't want that. I want the tablet. <laughs> You call the number five. Hello. Hello, who am I speaking with? Helen Copeland. All right, Miss Copeland, call the number five. You have to answer the question. Who was the first African American director or CEO of the Council on Aging? I have no idea. You have no idea? I have no idea. You don't want to guess? Uh, Okay, thank you. All right. Nine two three eight thousand three five nine. You got another chance to win the All right. tablet. All right, let's see if this. Let's see knows. if this person knows who's the All first right. African American executive five. director, CEO do of the you, Council on Aging. Do you know who's the first African American executive director of the CEO Council on Aging? Got sure you. Don't. You don't. You just started calling. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. Still have a prize here what to you win. Say? What you say? I just got excited and I just started dying. Oh, Lord. Go, go see if you can figure it out. You still All have right. a chance to win All this right, tablet. Facebook got it right a couple times. <laughs> All right. If, okay, look. If, if this you the last caller, we, if you don't have the answer, then I'm going to have to give it to somebody on Facebook. Do you know who the... Who, do you know who is it? It's you. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> who am I speaking with? Wanda Cook. All right, All yeah, right. it's me. How you Tasha know Wanda Clark? Hey, Wanda, the first, first African American, African -American CEO, CEO of Council, the on Council, on Council on Aging. What's your name, Wanda? What? Wanda Cook. Sh Shurik, you got it, Trudy. All Congratulations. right, come and get your tablet tomorrow. All right, congratulations. All right. All right, you all. We enjoyed today. It's Great been show. fun. Thank you all. And you'll give the updates on construction projects on, on the next on, show. On the next show. We'll do it next Sunday with Dr. Gilmore because on Tuesday we're going to be talking about a bunch of other stuff. And uh, we're going to play bingo. It's been a, great show. It's been a, it's great, been a show. great show. Thank you all for tuning in. And Dr. Gilmore will be back next yep, week. Next we, not only will we be playing bingo, but we got EBR paraphernalia. We got umbrellas. Wow. We got shirts. We got what kind of stuff we got, so Amanda? So because you, because stuff. you tune in, you get the opportunity to win. That's right. We just ask you that when you tune in to to, to learn and listen. Okay. Learn and listen. Thank and, you so and much. Share with another scene. Absolutely. All right. Y'all be Call blessed. Your neighbor. All right. All right. Take care. Take care. 
Okay. Good job, dude! Oh! 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 Oh!